double dip of baseball in town, both the Sox and Cubs at home. Matt Zahn is here with a look at ahead to the night's action, Matt. Yeah, but don't get that too often. Both of them at home, same time playing. The two, the Cubs go for two straight over baseball's best team. Kyle Hendricks tries to follow up on that Marcus Stroman gem as they face the Rays again. As for the White Sox, Lucas Giolito looks to help them snap a three-game losing streak. They are hosting the Angels. While the White Sox lost game one of that series, it still felt like a winning night on the south side as Liam Hendricks made his season debut in his return from that battle with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, throwing 27 pitches in an inning of work. It wasn't just the hometown fans showing Liam the love. He got support from all over, including from Cubs pitcher Jamison Tyone, who went through a battle with testicular cancer. The outpouring of love from not only White Sox fans, but fans all over the game, different organizations. I know that uh, the Blue Jays had sent a video of saying congratulations on being back. And I really hit home that it's not just guys here. It's guys all around the league. There's uh, Jameson Tyone and Trey Mancini both text me today among a plethora of other people. I mean, it's it's a like community that you don't want to be a part of, like the cancer community, not just in, in the real world, but in baseball. Like it's it's rare. Um, there's not many of us. I just wanted to be one of those positive influences for him just to let him know, like I've been through it. Um, I'm back on a big league field. And if you ever need anything, I'm here. But didn't want to like intrude either. He's obviously got a lot going on in his own life. But um, yeah, I'll be on his team forever. Yeah, Hendricks had previously said it was a message from Tyone that stuck with him, basically telling him to do whatever feels right for him when it comes to returning to baseball. Wow, that was powerful last night, especially yeah. all the signs. They have a campaign, don't they, like stand Close out cancer. Close out cancer. Yeah. They just... said they raised over $100,000 for lymphoma research with the T-shirts. Mm. Yeah. All right, Incredible. great stuff. Thanks, Matt.